Hey guys, it's Jackson here from Titanic Games, and today I just wanted to show you guys how to actually get the character that I've provided for you guys into um, Mixamo so that you can use the FBX for UE4 import option um, because that can provide more accurate retargeting. So um, I guess I recommend that over the normal FBX. So basically, what you'll do is you'll come to our little this this URL here and you'll just click to download the test model zip. Okay, so you'll click that, it'll download and do its thing. And once it's ready, you can just extract it to itself and it'll do its thing. All right, perfect. So next what we'll do is we'll go over to Mixamo. Okay, and we'll say upload, okay? And we'll select a character file and you see it takes in FBX, OBJ, uh, BVH and zip files. Um, and zip is usually used for if you have an OBJ with an MTL file. So um, that's what that's usually used for, but we're going to use the FBX option here. So we'll select our file. We'll go find the uh, test model file. Okay. And then we'll use this uh, test model FBX. Okay. So we'll take that and we'll open it. All right. Then it's going to go ahead and process the upload. All right, so once it's done processing, it should look something like this now. Um, yours might have, you know, um, you know, if you're if you're making your own character, I mean, yours might have materials on it. But with this model, right, we're not going to have any materials on it because we're only using it for retargeting animations. Okay, so we'll just hit next, and then it's going to ask you to kind of position the joints, um, just to kind of tell it how to rig it. So we'll take this chin and we'll position it kind of at the chin here. Okay. We'll do the wrists, put them kind of at the wrist position. It doesn't have to be super perfect, just get it in the closest that you can. Okay. Put the elbows there ish. And you can use the reference image here to know what to do. Um, we'll put the knees right about there. And then the groin right there ish. Okay, so then you can hit next. It's going to go ahead and process that and rig it for us. So once it's done, it should look something like this. Right? You'll have kind of this little idle pose that you know it just kind of moves through the simulation. Um, but it just you know it's just demonstrating that the rig works, so you can just observe all the body movement and see that everything looks like it's hooked up good. So if we hit next, you know then we can um, go ahead and choose to animate it. So if you hit animate, right, you can find some animations. Okay, pick one. You can say add to pack or whatever, add to my assets, view and download. All right, then if you hit Q download, go to format, FBX, you can choose the FBX for Unreal now. And then after you hit Q download, you'll be able to continue on with the, uh, the other video I have on doing the UE4 import. So um, with that, thanks for watching, guys. I hope this helps clarify any you know confusion. And uh, with that, we'll see you in the next one.